I don't know what's wrong with me today. I was actually so upset earlier on this morning and now it's like, it's, it's, it's a completely different me. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be talking about oils, anything from body oils to facial oils. And I'm going to be telling you about some of my favorite, favorite oils. So if you would like to see this video, then please do me a favor, do the damn thing. And watch the video <laughs> so I'm essentially somebody that loves to use oils I love to use oils on my face I love to use oils on my body and considering the fact that we're going into winter autumn time my skin is getting a little bit drier I can feel it girl I feel it it's getting a little bit drier and I kind of figured that you know what let me use some oils I'm changing my skincare and body care routine to incorporate oils into my you know routines into my systems and things like that <laughs> anyway so i'm going to be showing you some of my favorite oils that i use in the autumn and winter time and why i use them and why i prefer those types of oils where you can get them and how much they're going to be let's get started <laughs> so for the sake of consistency i just pulled up three facial oils and three body oils now the facial oils that i use a lot of them i can't i, I I can't even show you all the oils I use because you would think I'm a crazy person. So I picked some of the favorite ones that I've been using currently at this point in time. And I love facial oils because, and when I mean facial oils, I also mean cleansing oils. I'm a very, very big fan of cleansing oils, uh, cleansing balms. If I don't have a balm, like currently at the moment, I'm using the Clinique Take the Day Off Balm. If I'm not using a balm, then I'm using a cleansing oil. And I pulled up some of my all-time three favorites I've got a lot more but really we can't be here all day so I pulled up some of my all-time three favorite oils that I'm going to show you guys right now so let's get into the cleansing oils now my favorite all-time cleansing oil to remove makeup and also to cleanse my face afterwards after removing the makeup so that you get the first cleanse and then of course the second cleanse where I'm just washing my face and cleaning it up my all-time favorite one is this one this is the L'Occitane and Provence uh, <laughs> shea butter cleansing oil this is one of my favorites I've loved this oil for years now ever since I started getting into L'Occitane which is give or take maybe three years ago I've repurchased this oil time and time and again this is a great oil because it's got great ingredients or great um, yeah, yeah, because it's got great ingredients that stimulate nourishment and enrich the skin, right? So this is the 5% Shea Butter Cleansing Oil. Shea Butter, if you do not know, is really, really well known for nourishing and enriching the skin. So putting back all the oils that you lose or even assisting some of your own nat natural uh, body oil. It's got a very, very silky texture. It's very, very efficient at removing makeup. It's really so quick. Now, I currently alternate between the Clinique um, Cleansing Balm and this oil, and I really, really love this one. It essentially removes all sorts of impurities. It removes makeup like a dream and has 5% Shea Oil, which is really, really good, as I said, for nourishing the skin. And then I have one oil that I use in the morning and one oil that I use in the evening. Now, part of, uh, oh, I have a love affair with this oil. <laughs> this is the Kiehl's Daily Reviving Concentrate. Now, I love this oil purely because it is a great, it's got a great mixture of, um, I believe, sunflower oils and ginger root oil, which is great for nourishment as well. But it's also really, really great because it also uh, sort of alleviates the, um, your skin looking tired and fatigued. I love to apply this oil before I uh, apply my makeup in the mornings. Sometimes I do it, sometimes I don't. I tend to get a little bit like lazy with the whole process, but I love this one and I continuously repurchase it. At the same time, I also love the, the Midnight Recovery Concentrate, which I also use at nighttime, but that is only when I feel like my skin is irritated. But this is a daily oil that I use all, all the time. It basically, corrects um, your skin looking tired, you know, the visible effects of your skin looking tired and fatigued, and it's a great, great oil. You can find this at uh, Kiehl's counters everywhere. 
everywhere Go. and then the last oil that i'm going to talk about is actually well in terms of the face is actually one of the like oldest oils that i've used like this is one of the first facial oils that i have bought like a long time ago and i just continue to repurchase it all the time this one is the clarence lotus face treatment oil i absolutely ugh. and i love clarence because it deals with a lot of plant extracts so it's really really good in terms of it being effective and working really well for your skin and of course not having chemicals and things like that in it this oil is one of my faves in terms of um, cleaning up the skin i love to use this one at night i think it's really Really great in terms of hydration cleaning up the skin it works so well at night time if you are looking to just um, you know rejuvenate and rehydrate your skin I absolutely love this treatment it's also really good if there are breakouts or if your skin is a little bit irritated somehow it's one of the best oils on the market for me personally for me that I could use and I absolutely like 110% love this oil. All right, and then moving on to dry body oils. Now, the reason why I say dry body oils because one can imagine that when you are using an oil on your on your body, you don't want it to be greasy and then stick onto your clothes and things like that. So normally a lot of the time, body oils are dry oils. So as soon as you uh, apply it onto your skin or onto your body rather, it works so well because it penetrates very very quickly and does not leave you feeling greasy or dry and I absolutely love dry oils in uh, I can't talk I absolutely love dry oils in the winter time and these are the three favorites that I absolutely love right the first one which I think pretty much is highly contested with this one and the other one but I really love this oil this is the nukes nukes I think uh, nukes multi-purpose dry oil and this is great for your face your body and your hair but it's absolutely wonderful for the body i love this oil it literally sinks in so quickly but is nourishing because as an oil it gives like extra extra nourishment and sinks in very very quickly into your um skin so pretty much this one i also love it because 98 or 97 percent of this oil is all organic plant extract so that's good so at least if you're somebody who worries about things like that or putting chemicals and all sorts of things onto your body this is 97 percent plant extract so you're pretty much good you can use this all throughout winter all throughout summer all throughout the year it really is great and i know of um i've read reviews of men who love this oil as well so you can you can use this with your boo girl or you can even buy it for your boo. If you know that your boo has dry, ashy skin, especially in the winter time, you could invest by buying them this. And it's really one of the best oils on the market for me, for the body. I love and it. The next oil, which I you may have seen on my Instagram page, maybe recently, this is the Elizabeth Arden 8 Hour Cream All Over Miracle Oil. Really, really good for face, for body, and for hair as well. And I love this one as well because it also includes a lot of natural, organic ingredients. Now, this one has... Um, shea butter it's got really nourishing ingredients it's got shea oil shea butter it's got shea oil it's got lavender oil if i'm not mistaken but it's really really nice especially i like to apply this one especially right out of the shower sometimes i don't even dry myself off as i'm wet i just spray it all over the body and then i rub it into my skin really nice does not leave you feeling greasy or anything like that and absolutely one of my favorite oils at the moment Lots. And then an oil with a purpose more than just hydrating and all that jazz. This is one of my favorite oils. And this oil got recommended to me by my good friend Kalenga from Curve Cut. I'll link her channel down below. You should follow her. If you're somebody who's all about skin and body and you know your skin looking right and feeling right and acting right you should follow her channel but she introduced me to the clarence tonic body treatment oil i absolutely love this now this is a firming and toning oil now girl you know we got them struggles right we got the whole cellulite struggle especially on our thighs and maybe sometimes people might have it on their arms as well but this is so good for toning and firming up the skin the one thing that i do want to reiterate though is that 
you have to be really patient, especially with oils that work in terms of... Can you hear that? You have to be patient, especially when it comes to oils that tone up and firm up the skin. So it doesn't really work immediately, but it works. As time goes along, it works. And I love to use this in the winter time because you want to get your skin right. You have to get your skin right for the springtime, right? Spring and summertime. So I love to introduce this into my everyday regime. Um, normally, I like to introduce it at nighttime because ugh, I just feel like the whole job of firming, toning and rubbing up your thighs, rubbing up your thighs or up your legs or up wherever the problematic areas are, you have to rub up uh, in order for, you know, gravity pillar. Yeah, well, so cellulite down. So you need to rub up. And I actually like to use it at nighttime because after then I take a shower and things like that. And then I will use this. In the morning, I don't have the time to be constantly rubbing. So I prefer to use it at nighttime. And a little goes a long way with this. Like you can have this. I can have this straight proper for a year without having to change it. I have only used a little bit. I bought it. I think maybe two or three months ago, I've literally, I haven't even dented this thing. So I really love this. Well worth it. You can get it at the um, Clarence counters and 100% pure plant extract. So if you're somebody who's worried about that, do consider that this is 100% pure plant extracts. Okay, and that's it from me. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful in some way. Definitely do look up oils and see the benefits of oils, but oils are really, really good for your skin, especially when it comes to the drier, colder months. But these are some of my favorites. Let me know if there's an oil that you would like me to try out. Also, please don't forget to like, subscribe, share. Thank you so much. For now, I am gonna go. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will definitely, definitely, See you in the next one. Bye.